come in contact with. And her and her uh, amazing husband who actually ironically gave me my first job in 1996, Zachariah Abdurrahman, they gave me the opportunity sure. to be a part of an organization that is more worried about the change than the spotlight. And a lot of times, just from my humble uh, experience, and I haven't been in this uh, arena for a very long time, but one of the things that I noticed that they're more focused on pulling their, their sleeves up, getting down and dirty to make change in our community. And one of the changes that they have dedicated their lives to make under the huge umbrella of the nice town CDC is the gun and violence initiative called Pushing Progress Philly, commonly known as P3. And just a quick outlook on what Pushing Progress Philly is, it is a 12 month training and supportive service program that provides participants with paid employment, job training, and coaching services. And how does that look? What does that look like? Basically, it looks like that all participants receive stipends for good attendance, participation in life skills, work readiness training, behavioral change, coaching, employment, and goal-oriented things, for example. In our program, we just don't focus on the root of the problem, but we focus on the behavior. We focus on the behaviors. And from the behaviors, we realize that a lot of our people that we run into, they stop setting goals. They don't have any goals outside of the environment that they are in. And what we did was we realized that there's only one reason that people don't achieve their goals. There's only one main reason why people don't achieve their goals. And we all have this in common. We allow our excuses to be more important than us achieving the goals. Mm. We allow our excuses to be more important than transformation in our communities. We're African American. We can't get ahead in our communities. We have criminal backgrounds. We can't get ahead in our communities. So we stop. We stop having goals. We've been molested. That's the reason for me to act out in society. I come from a one parent household. That's the reason for me to stop going after our goals. So we train our participants and we go deep down into the hoods of the 19144 zip code. And we met some participants and we introduced some of these participants to this transformative education that we're giving them. And these, and these participants, not only were active, but they're currently active. And what I mean by active, I mean they getting down and dirty for the opposite of what we're doing. We taught them that until you, until change becomes more important than you staying the same, you're never gonna change it. So that's the mind shift that we're teaching our participants and it's been working. We have wraparound sessions that gave us access to participants on levels that we could have never imagined. So we believe that when you change the mind, you'll change the environment. P3, pushing Philly, we're here to stay. God bless you all, thank you for coming. You could have been anywhere else, but you chose to stay here in the rain and now the sun is shining. God bless you all. All right, the sun is shining. It's a beautiful.